Que rollo con el poema, my Jersey Seekers. Welcome back to a brand new video. So for today's vlog, we're gonna be doing another upgrade to the black truck, aka the show truck. Um, it's something that you guys have already seen in my previous videos. We're gonna be installing a tighting window. You guys already know the one and only my boy Reyes, located in Riverside, is gonna be doing it. We actually came to the same shop for my parents' crew cab, and we did it. Uh, we did it on my SS cone as well. And again, we're gonna be doing it on my black truck. As I always tell you guys, good work. Um, speaks for itself. There's a reason why I keep coming to this shop. Why? Because it's good work. Speaks for itself. You know, he gets down for the tiling windows. Um, he goes out of his way to do a neat job. And that's what we want, you know, for, especially for nice trucks like this, like a show truck. When we go to shows, people check him out and stuff like that. He's a guy to come to. So yeah, right now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna be showing you guys um, the before from the inside and the outside. I'm gonna be showing you guys the after later when we, when we come pick it up. Um, he didn't give me an exact date on when he's gonna have it ready, but he said it should just take a couple of days. Since we're never in a rush, we like to um, let these jobs work in peace. Um, that's not a problem with us, you know. Another thing that we're shooting for is we're trying to do the starlight um, headliner so that it can light up like kind of like Rolls Royce lights, you know. So we're gonna be doing that. But the only thing is, he said he doesn't know um, if he's gonna have time to do that um, this week. This week, while he already has a truck, or he's just gonna have to do it later on. So we don't know exactly if when I come pick it up, it's gonna be done or not. But regardless, we're gonna be doing that, and he's gonna be doing it. But we're already here at the shop right now, so let's just show you guys the before. Let's go say what's up to him. And then from there, let's just wait for the, let's just wait for it to be done. So check it out, guys. This is the before right here. Just a regular window with a twisted metalworks. The guy who did all this amazing work. Um, yeah. So basically, the difference is that there's gonna be a big window in the middle, and it slides up and down um, with, with just with the push of a button. And but the other windows come off of the Titans. I forget what years. I'll ask my boy right now. But yeah, look at this. This is the before. And then let me show you guys on the inside so you guys can see. This is what it looks like from the inside. But later on, we're going to be able to push it up and down. And we're already here at the shop. So let's go say what's up to my boy. And right off the bat, I'm already seeing a whole bunch of windows. So look at this. He has a shit ton of windows. I'm telling you guys. There's one, two, three, four, five. Look at that. And like I said, the only difference is that this, this middle piece, it goes up and down with just the push of a button. And these come off of the Titans. Look at the shop. Pretty cool, pretty badass. Um, and right now he looks like he's doing, he's working on a headliner suede. And look at what we're finally picking up. My mom's smart car. I have bad news, but I'll be explaining in a bit. What up, my boy? What up? Say what up. Sheesh. And you got more windows or no? Or that's it? He ha said he has more over there. Let's check this out. Look at all that. More freaking windows. So make sure you guys hit him up. And then he has all the motors right here to make them work. Look at this thing, man. You know, so we're gonna have to start putting this together. Like I said, I have bad news. But I'll explain once I get to my house. He has some, these are the old windows. But look at his cars. Damn. He was telling me that he just got some more work on it, some pinstripes, King Enemy. Damn. I don't know too much about these cars, but I know they're worth an arm and a leg. So, yeah, guys. We're not going to be driving back home in this little car. And we're going to be leaving my black truck. Hopefully, we don't get a ticket for driving like this. All right, my Jerry Tucker. So, the time has came. Um, time to pick up my black show truck. Keep you guys updated. But the good news is that they were able to do the Starlight headliner, the Rolls Royce lights as well. So, it took a little bit longer than it should have. But it's okay because, like, like I told my boy, we're in no rush. We don't really need the truck. Um, so they went ahead and put installed the tiny window and did the, the headliner with the star headlights. Um, if you guys can't notice, we came in little blue and the SS clone to pick up the other truck. Um, and we're going to be dropping off this truck because it's having a little bit of problems with the, with the passenger window going up and down. I don't know if you guys remember that one truck show when I went to Arizona where um, we had to like, they didn't want to let me burn out. So we had to tape it up and stuff. You know, so that's what we're going to be. Uh, we're going to be dropping off this one. Um, so my boy can take care of it since he's a genius with wiring and all that stuff. So let's go look at the black truck. I already see it. It's over here. 
Let's go look at it. A ver cómo quedó. So there it is, guys. There it is. And this fun fact: this is Lalo's favorite truck, right? Yeah. Mi compa Lalo said. I know there was a couple of you guys asking that. What is gonna be Lalo's next truck build? He said he wants a new, a newer year, something like this. But look at this. I'm telling you guys, my boy is the best um, Titan window installer out there. Look at this. He goes out of the way and he adds this, like, uh, forget what it's called. Como silicone or whatever, algo así. And look at the mask. I just noticed. Man, it's a like, gold oh, me sound system. I guess, I'm guessing because it hits the, it hits the, como se dice? Um, with the Titan window motor. And then there is my old window. That sucks. Look at this. I just noticed one of my freaking, they were actually popped. I blame the compa Lalo for this. Look at that. So, I don't know. We're gonna be uh, figuring out what happens with that. But yeah, let's check this out. Come on, I'll the headliner now. Ooh, hell yeah, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see them, but I'll be showing you guys in the night. So that it looks a little bit more, uh, more better. All right, guys, so check it out. Here is a night shot. Um, it's already nighttime, but my truck is parked right under the the light pole, the city light pole. But either way, you could see them pretty clear now. Look at this. I don't know if you guys can see that. Look, there's, I have it on all the colors as well. So that looks really, really good. And then look at that tiny window back there. So... Once again, that's some badass work. And check it out. This is the control that we use right here to control it. So it comes with a lot of different settings. If I just want red, I do is push the red button. It just stays on red. If I want green, we can just click on green, blue. And then it has some modes right here as well uh, to flash. So it, could just, it just flashes like a Christmas tree. And then I, or not, there's Fade. This is what I love, the Fade 7. So this one just, uh, it fades away to all the colors that it has. It has it as well in Fade 3, which is just three colors, I believe. It has Jump, Jump 7. I'm not sure what that means. Also, it just jumps right to it. But my personal favorite is the Fade. The ones where they fade away slowly. Yeah, my Jerry Tinker, so as I was editing this video, ready to close it out, I realized I never explained what's up with the smart car. Um, so here I go. I'm going to be explaining what happened with the smart car. So I don't remember if you guys remember. I made a video a couple of uh, months ago where I was saying that the smart car that we bought was having electrical problems and that the electrician people couldn't really find out um, what the problem was. But I took it to my boy and he was my last hope because he's a genius. Um, so he actually ended up not being able to find the problem. So that's already almost a total of five shops and they could not figure out the problem. And my boy was my last hope. Uh, and the reason what they're saying is because these are smart cars, you know, just by the name of the car, smart car. Um, these cars, they added a lot more things um, for them to be a little bit harder to work with. When something's wrong with it, it's not that easy to find. And that's exactly what happened with this car, you know. But my parents lost complete hope in this car. Um, they're actually shopping for a newer car. So this car is actually mine now. But I don't know exactly what I'm going to be doing to it. I don't know if I'm going to be keeping it. I'm giving it away, crashing it, destroying it, going off-roading it. So comment down some cool ideas that I could do with that small little car. But all that's really wrong with it is nothing major, the engine, all that. Everything works great. The only thing that doesn't work is when you brake, the backlights don't turn on, and also the turn signals don't work. But my parents just don't want to risk it with the cops, but you guys already know Jerry Tweak. Le vale madre. So that's why it is my car now, so I'm going to be doing whatever I want with it. But comment down, like I said, your guys' ideas. But that's going to be it for today's vlog. Don't forget to smash that like button. So comment down what you guys think about the Titan window, the new headliner, and also what I should do with the little car. If you're new to my channel, become a driver ticket to subscribing, and I will see you guys in my next vlog. Peace.